Hey guys, and welcome back to Turok. We last left off, we were kind of in the shit with some weird beastie trying to break down the door. Oh, hello. Oh, bugs. Oh my god, what the fuck is this? Well, I mean, I guess... <laughs> I guess our... Our um, red shirt has gone. Whoa, this is like Starship Troopers. Ooh. So, bugs? We're fighting bugs now? Alright. And that dude was just so excited. We were just about to go home. Unlucky friend. Now, can we kill these guys, I wonder? With our trusty knife. Did that dude... Yes? No. Ooh. I was hoping he left his flamethrower behind, which of course he didn't because he's a goit. Oh well. Alright, let's get out of here, Slade. I like these bugs. Ooh. Of course there was lots of gribbly bugs in um, Turok from the N64. Wow, we've got a whole nest. Oh dear, this is, this is getting a bit much. I kind of don't want to get overrun here. I don't want to put my minigun down. Oh, I'm dead. <laughs> Holy shit. Ooh. Uh, wow. Talk about getting totally wiped. Uh, maybe, just maybe, might be worth putting this thing down. Oh, we can't put this? Yeah, wait, there we go. Now, one thing about the Gatling gun is although we can put it down, uh, we do have to reload it manually, which is not great. I guess Slade's got the Gatling gun. Get to the ladder. What ladder? Okay, how are we doing? How are we doing? Can I have, can I have this back, please? Thank you. Alright, shotgun ain't brilliant against these things. Trouble is, oh shit, shotgun isn't really designed for armor penetration. Eeh. It will give me a headache, that's about it. Ooh, yes, minigun ammo, sweet. Let's go. So, bugs you say? Interesting. Must admit, oh god, this is like fucking Starship Troopers. I feel like I'm Rico. Ah, I don't think a flamethrower would have really helped those guys out, bearing in mind. Okay, what we oh, what have you got? Tech arrows? I'll take those bad boys. What else is going on here? Um, no. Can't get up. Alright, where are we going? Come on, Slade. There's a helicopter somewhere. Where was our chopper? Are we climbing up here? Uh, nope. I know we can climb. Ah, right, you know, the big fucking, yeah. Oh boy. Oh boy, how effective are arrows? Probably not very effective at all. It certainly doesn't look like it. Maybe that's why they give us the tech bow. Or the tech arrows. Alright. Um. Oh, hello. Something's having a wonder. More bugs, of course. Yeah, even the minigun's not exactly super effective against them. I don't think anything's going to be super effective against these fucking things. Although we can hold a thousand rounds. Ah, more tech. Oh yeah, we can only hold ten tech arrows, which is a bit weak source if you ask me. There we go. It does mince them up quite nicely when they're just coming straight at you. Get fucked. Any trouble is, bugs... Oh, he's got a Gatling gun. Nice. <laughs> See the way he spins around on that. That's brilliant. Oh, I like it. Uh-oh. 
Uh oh. Okay, I don't like this. I don't like this. Slade, any chance of a bit of help? You might not like me, Slade, but you are fucked without me. Just as I'm going to have a very rough time without you. Yeah, best thing is to not let that thing overheat, Slade. But I'm sure you knew that. Is there an achievement for killing bugs? I don't think so. Oh, Slade, did you just roast my ass? Okay. Yep. You only got so much ammo. Yeah, me too, buddy. Me too. The Xbox has only got so many CPU cycles, too. Clearly not enough. Right, let's get out of here. Oof. Right, let's move on. Ow! Well, luckily, stabbing these things in the ganglion seems to get the job done. One bad thing with the Gatling gun is... Oh, nice. If I actually get stuck halfway through using it or knocked off... Oh, great. Knocked off... Come on. Halfway through using it. Um, it does kind of glitch the barrels out a bit. Which is annoying. Alright, this is actually a better minigun than the one we've got. Got ya. Come on, Slade. Move your ass. There we go. Shit. Overheating. All right, let's keep this party wagon going. This whole Gatling gun, Gatling gun fun. I like me this Gatling gun, that's for sure. See, this is the type of Gatling gun I want to take home. This is the sort of Gatling gun you take home to see your mother. She's smooth, she's fiery, and she always hits the mark. Not like the one I've got in my back pocket. Uh, she's a growler. Unaccurate, unreliable, heavy, unwieldy, you know. But this thing's spicy. Oof. And she's stable, too. Stability's good. We like stable weapons. I think we're going to exterminate. Yeah, they should be extinct. I think we're going to extinct the whole lot of them. Just here, me and my Gatling gun. Uh, Slade, are you actually working on anything productive down there? Oh my god. You know, one thing that I think is quite impressive of what they did is the physics engine on the actual enemies themselves. It's really cool the way they kind of ragdoll and they have so many different parts to them. That's definitely something that was unique at the time. But obviously, uh,. It certainly is a lot for the Xbox to process at times. Oh, right, I see. Let's try and get Slade to push forwards. Can we get off, please? Thank you. Alright. You're a killing machine. Oh, yeah. Oh, hi. Hi. <laughs> he says, please don't singe my beard, mate. Or oh, my lovely mohawk. I think you've just done more damage to me than they ever will. Thanks for that, Slade. Oh my god, frames. Can I have some frames, please? Jesus, Crudler. There we go. Run for it? Well, I mean, sure. Run with a knife. Why do I think this isn't going to go well? Ah. I guess because it's not going to go well. Oh dear. Fucking bugs. Uh. Congratulations, Turok. That was a perfect strike. 
Unfortunately, these aren't the targets, but we'll find them. Even if we have to kill every goddamn peasant in this backward country. Oh shit. Grimes, burn it down. The rest of you fall out. Kill her. No innocence. It's just a girl. Oof. So that's why he defected. Hmm, understandable. Ooh, we have a flamethrower. Nice. Well, down and out. Find Slade. Yeah, something tells me Slade's not dead. I do like these gribbly motherfuckers. They remind me of the arachnids for sure. Ooh. What do you think of that? Huh? Huh? Yeah, you don't like that. And you. Yes, every beast understands that fire is not something to fuck with. I like the way they back off, actually. That's cool. What's the alternate fire? Ooh. It's got a grenade launcher. I like the reload. That's cool. It's like we've got a portable can of gas on us, like a lighter. We just top the fucker up every now and again. <laughs> well, it's a good thing there's a flamethrower ammo dotted all over the place as well. God, I love video games. Right. Well, cheers for the weapon, Slade. Oh. I see. I see. Well. Look at the way they back away from the flame. They definitely did try with this game. No one can say they didn't. Definitely don't want these fucking eggs hatching behind us, which I wouldn't be surprised if that's a thing. Oof. Giz War 2 style. Giz War 2? Giz War 4 style, I should say. I'm gonna burn this whole hive. Hello. Come to daddy. Daddy's got what you need. A high intensity breakfast of pure butane. Or hopefully some kind of horrific futuristic chemicals. Ooh. Yeah. Yeah. I was afraid of that. Son of a bitch. Ugh. Yeah, I think we're going to lose the way back. Right, okay, so we do actually have to jump over that. Ugh. Yeah, technically, the dinosaurs are meat as well. Do we have to? Yes, we do. Okay. Right. We jump over the bridge. Jump over the bridge, Titan. Don't fuck around. Jump over the bridge. Although, when this little shit stain comes up... Ooh. You and your whole family, boy. Coming for all of you. Yeah, shot. I don't know. Shotguns aren't bad, but uh, the flamethrower is just where it's at. This thing is just sexy. Who doesn't like a flamethrower? Ooh, hello. Do we give him short bursts or do we go for maximum intensity? I don't know. Mm. Short bursts definitely does seem to be the way forwards. Probably not smart to be wasting all this ammo either, in hindsight. Oh, acid. Ugh. Fuck me, we can have eggs for breakfast. We want to eat that shit though. Ugh. I can hear them down there. There's something in the trees. Although it's not trees. It's a cavernous tunnel of doom. Oof. Right. Uh, yeah, so... Let's make with the jump, Turok. There we go. Jesus fucking Christ. We're not going back that way, are we? 
Flamethrower ammo. Nice. We're tops up on that stuff now. No, we're not going through here. Really? You sure? Uh, are you sure? We have to go through here, surely. Because there's nowhere else to go. Or is there? Nope. Definitely nowhere else to go. Um. Ooh. Oh, great. Brilliant, Tarok. Oh, I mean, that worked. Wasn't quite what I had in mind, but sure. One thing about this shotgun, though, it cycles fast. Which is pretty good for a shotgun, to be fair. Automatic shotguns are pretty sexy. And I love destroying these egg sacs. Oof. So satisfying, so squishy. I believe a certain somebody used to shout at me when I did that in Halo. Uh, no, Halo. In um, Gears of War 5? When I kept shooting the egg sacs. Yes. But they're so satisfying when they pop and they're deliciously juicy. Ooh, what's up here? I actually make a very similar sound effect as well, in all fairness. I have no fucking clue if I'm going the right way. Probably. Yeah, I guess so. Wow, there's a lot of dead dudes down here. Napalm grenades. Say what? Oh, I'm always down for some napalm grenades. Do we select the different grenades or are we just only loaded the napalm grenades? These are the finer questions in life. You always want to know what flavor your grenades are. Oh, I hear you. I hear you. Come to Big Bear Turok. Come for a hug and kiss. Well, that's not very friendly. Oh, there you are. Hey, friend. Uh, no, I guess. Oh, napalm grenade. That's got to be uh, for our flamethrower, thinking about it. That makes sense. Ah, so these things can get stuck on their back. That's pretty cool. And they dissolve away. That's why we get napalm grenades. I guess. But I'd rather keep them. Got loads of fire. Ugh. God damn it. Wow, we've got nine napalm grenades, so... Eh. I guess we might as well spend a few. It feels like a waste when they're not going into enemy flesh. I wonder if we could eat these things. Probably not, because they're acidic. Get fucked. And you. Oh, God, that's satisfying. They so could have done a Starship Troopers game with this engine. Well, I mean, technically, this is Unreal Engine, but it can make anything with Unreal Engine, apparently. So satisfying. It's worth a frame rate hit. There we go. Yeah, why did we never get a decent Starship Troopers game? Such a shame. I mean, of all the sci fi universes that they could turn into video games, um, Starship Troopers, like, hello. Not even sure how you could fuck that up. Considering um, there was a Starship Troopers mod for um, StarCraft, the original StarCraft, and it was brilliant. I remember playing that back in school. I'm pretty sure there was that, a new Starship Troopers game coming out, um, but I can't even remember if that's like meant to be released yet. Alright, I guess we're going down the hall. 
Oh, oh, hello, motherfucker. Push your ass back into the caverns. Yes. Up against the wall. Burn, you son of a fucking bitch. Mmm. Smelling good. Alright, who's next? Picked up some fucking grenades. Good. It's Hebrew. Damn it. Those grenades are very bouncy. I wish we could just, like, roll them or something. But, hey. I guess they do the... Oh, God. Fucking hell. Jesus Christ. I hope we're wearing steel toe caps. That would have been pretty savage otherwise. Are we going up here? I could have swore. No, I guess we're going back. Really? Alright, going back, I guess. Let's just hope there's nothing flammable in these caves. You know, quite often, there's all sorts of nasty gases in caves. Especially the further you go down. Yep, looks like we're going down. I can hear you. You little bastards. I like the way the uh, flamethrower pilot light there does light the surroundings. That's pretty cool. Okay, she's got some range. She's got some range. We like that. We like flamethrowers with range. Ooh, dude. Jesus. How the fuck did Slade survive? Bearing in, bearing in mind he's got no... Um, no weapon now. Well, I guess he doesn't have any weapon. Unless he's dead. I mean, I honestly can't remember. Uh, I, I guess he's not. Because he's too much of a dick penis man to die. And I still think it's going to end up like, you know, being best buddies and, Oh, Tarok, you saved me. Blah, blah, blah. I guess you did love my brother after all. Or some bollocks like that. You know it's going to happen. I know it's going to happen. But who knows? Maybe they're going to throw something a little bit different at us. I last played this game, what, 13 years ago, so... Oof. I definitely expected to see more of these bugs down here, considering the surface crawls. These bloody scorpion things. Oof. We've got nothing. Jesus Christ. This place is coming apart at the seams. Getting some decent alien vibes. Ooh. Objective. Find Slade. Yeah. He's probably off being a bitch somewhere. Right, there we go. I can actually stand up now. Ah. Yes. I think I remember this. Uh-huh. Yeah-huh. Yep. Um, mm-hmm. There's that save. Yep. I remember this. Alright, let's go explore these terrifying depths. Mm-hmm. Definitely juicy down here. Perfect place for bugs. But apparently these bugs have some kind of toxin. I'm not sure what that's about. Flamethrower fuel. Oh, this looks ominous. <laughs> There's a bridge. Oh, look, you can even see the fracture points in that bridge. Yes. Totally going to fall apart. Flamethrower ammo. Uh-huh. I'll have it. Now, where the hell is Slade? 
Napalm grenades, cool. Oh. Hello. You're an ugly fucker. Um. Kill the beast. Well, we shall endeavor to try. I'm guessing it's not gonna like fire. I also remember having a minigun here. But I can't remember for sure. Oh, it's starting to get bloody. Ooh, right in the face. And again, that's it. I remember the tentacles. Come on, you ugly son of a fucking bitch. Ow! My face. Now, if memory serves, I can destroy the tentacles somehow. I'm sure I can. Jesus. Let's get this shotgun going to work. Shall we? Let's get this shotgun actually working for us. Ow. Reload. Reload. Definitely getting lost. And stuck on items here, which is not brilliant. Wow, look at you. You fucking... Look at this thing. It looks like some sort of weird eel. Which is cool. I can dig it. Ooh, right in the face. Yes. That's how we do it around here, boys. Yes. I'm going to have fried calamari with this fucker. Ooh, burn your face off, sir. Yeah, you don't frighten Turok. You might frighten Slade. Slade seems to be a bit of a Jesse. But you ain't scaring Turok. And I know somewhere around here is a Gatling gun. I remember it. Well, that's all of our bloody grenades gone. Uh, oh, we have tech arrows. Not bad. Okay, tech arrows don't seem to quite be as deadly as I was hoping they were going to be. So please stop throwing rocks at me. That's really not very decent of you, to be fair. Yep, nice try. I think it's going to take more than a fish to be the end of Turok. To be honest. Ooh. Although I might kill myself, apparently. Uh weapons, ammo. I know there's a bloody minigun here somewhere. Unless Slade throws that to us at some point. Can't remember. Ow. Please stop throwing rocks at my face. That would be really cool of you. Yeah, it doesn't look like there's anything here. Anything with any range. Come on. Bite me, mummy. Bite me. Ah. Uh, oof. We need some health. There we go. Load up. I'm sure we could hit his tentacles somehow. Sure, I remember that. Oh, God. Alright, wait for it to come to me, I guess. You gonna offer any assistance, Slade? Anything at all? No? Alright, buddy. That's cool. Right, flame your face. Flame in the face. Nozzles are hot, boys. There we go. Your face ain't looking so pretty, mate. I'm just gonna come out and say that. Can we? No, we can't even walk up there. Right, well. Let's go back to the old bow then, because I'm not convinced the flamethrower is doing much. Not doing enough, anyway. There we go. How does that sting, dude? It'll turn you into a pincushion. Oh! The actual arrows are 
falling off it. Unless when it gets up close like that. Might have to go in for some kind of knife kill maybe. That is the Turok way. Come on you fucking bastard. Burn. Right, let's see. Let's see if we can go in for a knife kill. Kind of... Nope, there's no knife kill action coming up. So, we're just going to continue roasting the bastard with this, because that's all we have at this point. This is all we have. I'm not even sure if that's doing jack. I can't even see the angle that this thing's getting on me, to be fair. Nope. Uh, Slade, if you've got any ideas, I wouldn't mind hearing them, because I'm kind of running out of equipment here. Ow. Dick. Slade, dude. I don't even know where he's run off to, to be honest. Yep. Yep. Flamethrower is definitely ineffective. Um, right. Bugger. Uh, shit. There we go. Ooh. What the fuck was that? Something just blew up. Come on, buddy. There you go. That's all we have on him. Uh, we shoot his tentacles, maybe? God knows. Definitely not doing... Ah! Could there be something that we have to knock onto his head? Maybe. Got to be more equipment around here. Definitely remember there being a Gatling gun here, which is what's putting me off. I reckon something eventually happens, but it hasn't happened yet, apparently. Definitely remember taking its tentacles out as well. But these arrows are just chinking off its armor. Which is a bit awkward. Right, let's throw a grenade at it. That didn't do much, apparently. Shoot a flare into it. That's also not doing much. Um... Almost out of uh, options here, Slade. So, if you've got any cool ideas, let's see them, buddy. Because <laughs> this is getting a little bit delicate. Let's just say that. Ooh, fuck. Ooh, fuck. I mean, he's bloody. So, logic would say that he's injured. He's just not injured enough. That's the problem. So, last bit. Oh god, he's throwing stalactites at us now. Stalagmites. Does that mean he's running out? He's also throwing things much faster. Which is good. Come on, try and bite me. I didn't say bite me, you fucking dick. I said try and bite me. There's a distinct difference. There we go. Alright. Keep dodging. Keep dodging. Just gonna keep dodging. Uh, we're stuck on something. Yeah, we're stuck on something. There's so much stuff here to get stuck on, which is not great. Uh, yep, we're stuck again. But that's fine. Unless every time he charges and misses, he gets hurt. That could be a thing. 
Oh god, we just got squished. Right. Well. <laughs> I'm going to have to end it there, guys. When we come back, I guess we're going to have another go at this fucker. <clears throat> We've obviously got the wrong weapon there because the flamethrower doesn't seem to do dick against him. Neither does the bow. It just pretty much bounces off. I guess we got to shoot him in the mouth, maybe? But that's a hell of a shot. Hmm. Anyway, guys, thanks for watching. Till next time.